everything is for sale. Well, I lost the bet on this one. Here's some money. Yes. Yes. I got it. I got the bicycle. I finished my tier one jobs and now I have the bicycle. Yay! Oh man. They have a forge. Okay, I'm gonna have to go with the bicycle. Nice. We'll do a special job later. Woohoo! I got my bike. I got my bike. I got my bike. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to seven days. Day eight. Time is 1224. I did play a couple days off camera because I just wanted to uh, focus on the mod, learning the mod and uh, learning, learning and just getting a grip and adapting to this mod. So yeah, I took a couple days to do that for myself. Um, just want to say thank you to all the comments on the first four episodes. There was a lot of good comments, got a lot of good tips and thank you. I appreciate that. That really helps. Um, okay, so I guess that there is a bulletin board where you can take on quests that are different from the regular trader jobs, and I did not know that. So the comments mentioned the bulletin board, and I think it's this one, right? Yep. So I can interact with this. I did not know that. I never would have seen that if there was no viewers telling me <laughs> that. So these are different kind of um, jobs. Nurse you back to health challenge. So let's see here. I've never done this before. I've never seen this menu. Let's see what's going on. Hey survivor, you've, if you've come into possession of this note, then you should know we've been tailing you. We like your style, but before we roll out the red carpet to your camp, or to our camp, let's see if you can handle this little test. Crazy, and I like it, Jake. Challenge, kill some nurse zombies. Okay. Um, so, you buy it. Okay, and then what do you do with it? So let's see here. You read it? So it's like a treasure hunting, right? It's basically tre like treasure hunting, but you're purchasing the note and then you go and do the little mission. Okay, so we can read this. Okay. Hey, survivor. Okay, so th that's the same thing. And then we can accept. Okay, so it says kill some nurse zombies. Kill nurse zero of three. Okay. Um, I think I hear zombies. What do you need? Oh, nurse. Oh, so it comes to you. The job comes to you. Okay, I did not know that. I thought I had to go somewhere. I thought I had to go to a spot, but they send you the <laughs> they sending you the nurses right away. Okay, so uh, that that job is done. <laughs> so we talked to the trader. I don't care what folks say about you in the wasteland. Oh, you're almost okay. In nice. My book. Two thousand XP. 500 dukes and 10 Riscal arcade tickets. Awesome. Yeah, I was wondering how you get those uh, yellow tickets and now I know. Awesome. All right, cool. So let me see what else I can do. All right, um, I'm guessing the yellow ones are the easier challenges and then these red ones are a little bit, a little bit more difficult. Getting goose to challenge. Ugh. I do not want to deal with goose or geese. They they killed me last time, so 
Okay, let's try this yellow one. This note is a personal invitation to join our clan. We've been following you and see potential. Okay, do this job and we'll think about letting you join. Let's see if you're tough enough to kill these zombie dogs. Oh God. All right, let's buy it. Um, okay, let's get into a safe spot and then I can, I can spawn in the dogs. Right here? Or maybe up here. Okay, right here. This should be good. All right. So let's go ahead and read this and spawn in the dogs. Okay, let's go. Zero of five, okay. Um, are they gonna come? Where are they? Or maybe I need to go search for them. I don't know where dogs are. All right, I believe I have enough materials for the forge now. I've been working on getting some stone and I went and looted um, some of the jobs that I have done previously. So now I have plenty of materials and I can make a forge. Yay! So let's go ahead and craft. It's gonna take about five minutes. Great. Okay, so um, I gathered all of these books from looting and I wanted to save them to open them on on camera. So here we go. Uh, batter up volume six. Power attacks with clubs have 20% chance to ragdoll enemies. Nice. Very nice. Let's go ahead and use that. This one. Spear Hunter volume two. Take care of your spear and it will take care of you. Spears degrade 20% slower. I'm not going with spears, but we can still read it. This one. To serve human issue number two. Hunt your meals from a distance like the coward you are. <gasps> Unlocks the camel sniper rifle recipe. Hmm. That's interesting. I like sniper rifles. Camel sniper rifle recipe. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna check that out. Let's use that. Uh Bernie Shaft mod schematic. Great. Uh flare fun ammo schematic. Okay. So I have to have a flare gun for this. Okay, this, the Gravedigger mod. Awesome, 25% 20 more damage against dirt. Read that. Archery, no one will see it coming. Bows do 10% more damage at night. Okay. Armor piercing arrows. Armor isn't any good if the arrow can pierce it. Learn how to craft steel arrows and bolts. Nice. That's actually pretty helpful. All right, this one I've already read. Learn how to craft advanced nails for the nail gun and finger gun. Okay, awesome. Robotic turret shells. Turn that robotic turret into a makeshift shotgun. Craft robotic turret shells, nice. Acid. Acid is an extremely rare and powerful crafting agent. Okay, yep. Flaming arrows. No ranger fantasy is complete without raining fire from the sky. Craft flaming arrows and crossbow bolts. Awesome. And then this. Kill move. Use all you have learned and unleash a deadly power attack. Downed opponent suffers 50% more damage from power attacks. Ooh. Nice, nice. Nice, nice. I like that. But I think that's only for spears, right? Yeah, I need more clubs. More books on clubs. But we'll read that. Awesome. And that's all the books I picked up. All right. So let's uh, work on my skills. Um, I have been spending skill points. I've put uh, one more to parkour. So if you haven't noticed, I can jump higher. <laughs> and um, I put another one in uh, Pummel Pete, I believe, was it? Yeah, I had another, I add another one into Pummel Pete. So my club now feels really good. Really, really good. And then um, I had uh, two more other points I had spent. I don't remember where I put them. But now I have three. And we can go ahead and use those as well right now. 
I'm gonna go ahead and put one into finger bang. A lot of people recommended the finger bang. Um, everyone was saying that the finger bang is pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and put one in there. That was to increase the uh, magazine size and the range up to 75, okay. Then red handed, the next level would be add burning damage to finger gun and finger cannon. See a doctor if burning persists. Persists. Five more finger weapons and finger gun and ammo. Yeah, I could throw another one into the finger bang. I don't mind. I like the, I like it. I like the gun. All right, so I think I'm gonna put my last point into minor 69er. Yeah. Nice. So those are all my points for now. And is the forge ready? Yes, it is. Yay! Let's put it down. We'll go ahead and put it down right here. Awesome! Beautiful. Now I can make nail guns. I mean, <laughs> now I can make nails for my finger gun. Um, so I need iron and clay. Okay. Oh, there's three slots. Cool. Awesome. The vanilla game only has two slots. <laughs> That's great. I'll put some fuel in. And then we'll go ahead and turn that on. And it'll just uh, burn those in. Okay, great. So I... I totally forgot that we have this advanced survival, like, kind of like a side quest or crafting quest. Yeah, um, yeah, I saw this at the beginning, but I totally forgot about it. And now I kind of want to see what that is all about. So basically, let's see, you just craft a workplace hazard sheet. Okay, so... Um, I just grabbed all the ingredients and I should be able to make this. Yep, okay, so I'm gonna craft this. Okay, and then what do I do with this? What do I do with this? It says... What is this about? A safety sheet on what you should not do to get de dead in the apocalypse. Although you probably will anyways. No one actually reads these things. Okay, so what do I do with this? Just hang it up? Just hang it up here? We have gone seven days without an accident. I don't actually know what this is all about. I'm trying to read it. Okay. This, am I supposed to read this and do something with it? Or do I just place it? <laughs> I have no idea. Alright, the next one is obtain three lanterns for the, the traders. Gather lantern. Zero of three. Okay. I mean, I do have lanterns right here. Oh, that counts. <laughs> These are the ones I stole from uh, Hugh. Hey, girl! Probably try to save on the ammo. Nice. Cool. Okay. So now that I've got my bike. And I've got my forge, and I'm um in a good a good spot. I need to start thinking about Horde Knight. 
So I need to start thinking about a horde base, how to set it up, where I'm going to set it up. Because um, my resource gathering skills are so low, it's going to take me longer. So I have to start early. So I'm going to start thinking about that. So check this out, I can buy a year or no cake from here and I believe that cures or that removes a, a lot of the stink. Uh, my stink level is at 47 so this is not good. I need um, 20 I believe. Yeah I need 20 tickets to buy this. So to get tickets I gotta do these jobs right, these side jobs. Alright so I'm gonna go ahead and um, buy. <sighs> And then, oops, my inventory is too full, so um, I'm going to go ahead and buy all of these. Buy and buy. So now I have three challenges that I could do. And hopefully I can get some tickets and then I can get the, the pill to reduce my stink. <laughs> <laughs> I'm letting that horde pass by. <laughs> Go away! Okay, so we have these little side challenges and I want to try to do them. Kill some skeletons. Okay, so... Maybe I should stand on the ground when I do this. Okay, let's go ahead and read. And we're gonna accept. Oh my gosh. There's a big one. I did not realize that. Ouch! Ouch! Ah, run, girl. Ouch. Uh, use it. Uh. Okay, good. <laughs> At least this, the big one is slow. Jeez, he's so big! I didn't think there would be that many. Ooh, got him. Nice. Alright. I should be able to pick these off. Good. A little one. There's a medium one. You're not dead. And another medium one. Two. Die. Woo! Nice. Talk to trader for my tickets, hopefully. Let me get my tickets. Oh, what's this? Little heads? Ten tickets. Not Yay! Great. Just don't let this go to your head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so do I have enough for 
this? Is this? Is it this? Uh, nope. This right here. Yes, the year year no cake. Yep. Let's go ahead and um. Why does it say craft? Okay, I guess we craft. Awesome. Okay. And let's go ahead and use that. It removes 50% stink. Okay. Use. Better than nothing. Okay. That helps a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> Alright. So, I have two more little side challenges here. This one. They are smart. They are fast. They are probably hunting you. Kill some velociraptors. Or I could go with this one. Need more proof that geese are a-holes? Take on this challenge and find out. Challenge. Kill these geese. Warning. Entities will spawn at your current position. Okay. Okay. I see. Okay. Whew. Let's do the geese one. Okay, are we ready for this? This is gonna be scary! Um, yep. There they are. Oh boy. Oh. Oh my god. This is not good. Maybe I can go to my base. Use my nail gun. Okay. Whoa. What's it? It's on fire. It's on fire. What was going on? Oh my god. Why is it on fire? Oh my god. Why is it on fire? Oh! Why is he on fire? Is there like a a fairy? Oh, oh shoot! Is it my nails? I don't think so. Oh my lord. There's uh, other things. Oh god. Oh, what? I didn't kill five geese? I thought there was five. There was more than five. What the? One. There's two. Three. Four. And five! I killed five. It says four out of five. Hey. The game cheated me. Alright, well, uh, I'm gonna go out here and see if I can find another geese. Or goose. Because I need to finish this before it ex expires, right? Because there's a potential for it to uh, expire. I need some geese. Where are you? Okay, I need to find a goose. That's what I'm looking for to finish this little side job. Where are you? I just need one. All right. I've ridden around the town twice and I have not found a goose to finish my 
my little challenge here. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna call it... We're gonna call it a day. And... Um, that's it. <laughs> awesome. This is the end of the episode, I believe. So, we made some pro progress today. I'm really happy with we what we did today. Lots of progress. Um, I got a forge. I finished the job, the tier one jobs. I got a bike and then uh, we figured out how to get yellow tickets and yeah, it's uh, really good. We got uh, a lot done today. Woohoo! Progress. All right. Thank you for joining me for this episode. I hope you had fun and I'll see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.